welcome back guys so in the previous video we have connected with them uh, connected with the mango dbs uh, using uh, mango db database url um, so right now i'm going to create a model okay i may enter the api folder we'll create model m o d uh, m o d e l s okay model so under this model we will create a product model so i will say p r o d u c t dot g s so we have our product modify here. So we will say um, const mon mangoes and require mon gosc. So we have imported our mango package here. So what I'm going to do is I will create a product schema. Yeah, p r o d u c d s c h e m a. Okay. So we have created our product schema. This schema will be uh, use from mangoes uh, and then we'll say schema okay so and under here we have like uh, object uh, schema uh, there will be name name and then uh, will be type will be string and require equal to two and then image I will say um, for the product we have image and then description radian and uh, radian like I, I will show you uh, description rating re, uh, number of review price count in stock like like here okay name image price count in stock rating review so uh, for the review uh, we don't have our review here so we will have like multiple review for this products so will be a real list that's why I will I will create like this for the review. R E we are EWS review will be like array. Okay. In that array list, uh, we will create another uh, schema called review schema. That's why um, we need to this is like a kind of um, relationship, okay? So I will create a review schema above. So I will create um, review schema like C O S T Cont R E V R E W review s e h e m a review schema will be also a stem from uh, mangoes schema and then we will have like object as in the review there will be like name so this name type will be uh stream okay and then require equal to two two okay so and also we have like radiant comment and and the user as well okay which user will be uh, writing review for this product that's why we need like this rating comment and then user for the user we we haven't uh, set up yet uh, so i will comment for now so uh, we have set up like products uh, products schema so we need to export this product schema so uh, it's very simple. We can say module 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 dot exports equal to uh, mangoes uh, m o n g o s e mangoes dot model. Okay. So we are going to export model products called products p o d u c d product comma um, product schema. Okay. This product schema and uh, we will see our model name will be products. So like this. So we will create another one called user. Before I create user model, I will add um, here as a user data, dummy data. Okay, see so users.js. So for the user, I will add. Um, I I I will um, um, do the same thing like we used before uh, for the products const users equal to array list. There will be array list as well. So I will say I will copy and paste two user like admin. Uh, admin dot admin and note dot com or admin at gmail dot com whatever it is. So we we haven't um, set up this one yet. Um, I will show you um, like for the puzzle one two three four five six, and then um, if we say like this, it will be show uh, puzzle as a string. So I don't want to do like this because it is not secure. So we need to use this one, uh, big uh, by crib, okay, big crib or by crib. So I already show you package um, here as a bcrypt.js so we will use this um, here 
okay so const uh, c o n s t const b c r y p d b crypt equal to require okay uh, e g i i require uh, b crypt okay b crypt js so uh, we can use this b crypt like this has a sense so i will show you b c r y p d g g s so this package if you use yen you can add with the yen uh, for me, like MPN IMP Crisp, but I already uh, installed this package in the first video. So as you see, uh, we can say var or const vcreate require vcreate js like this. And then uh, what we are going to do is, as you see, use a sense to hash a password. We, we, we want to hash a password and store in inside the database, MangoDB. That's why uh, vcreate.hash um, sense. This one sort, uh, we can say get sort sent 10, or you can say directly here as a 10 letter. So it will be storing uh, using the, the, the hash sense, and then sort will be 10, like, like directly like this. So I don't um, want to do multiple um, like this, okay? So I just say directly 10 here, and we, get, we will copy and paste here as well like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. This plain text will be, um, hash using bcrypt and then uh, the sort will be 10 here so we have our user but we need to export like module modu le dot export equal to users okay so our user is ready to use now I will close this user module and then I will create um, so uh, under the model I will create called new find called user okay user.js model so in this user.model we will say um, const like like a product mangoes uh, mangoes and then require require and when you will see mangoes so we have already import so after that you remember we need to uh, it will be Chris as well bc rypt okay because we need to um, store our password using, uh, I mean, not no request. RE to UIRE require uh, bcreate.js. So we have important two, uh, two necessary things. So we will create um, user schema, const user sgac and uh, sgheema schema equal new m1 us mangoes dot sce schema okay in this schema we will say object type and then name password and i will copy the data and show you here like this so name require email require password require it's admin um it, uh, for the default we will say no okay false mean no it's not admin whenever I use a new user create it's not admin say okay so timestamp i will create a um, timestamp for this as well so after this uh object editor we will say timestamp will be true like this so timestamp will be automatically added for the id um for the id uh, right now we don't need this pre uh i will comment later we will use it okay so for the module i will export mod user module module dot exports equal to uh, m1 gos mangoes dot mod el we will say uh with the capital letter user and then user schema okay so we have our user schema and product schema as well so we can uh, and comment this one for the user um it will be like mango schema type object id because um their user of their user id will be automatically assigned by the mango that's why we need uh, object id and then require to we will say this uh, user is referenced from the user model here this user model okay so it's relationship between um review schema and user so for this review schema we need to add here okay so this review schema will be array that's why we need uh, we need to work with the, with the with the square bracket and then we have already set up our user and products okay so for the user it's the same thing like uh, we used before here 
we can text with the API user blah blah so I don't want um, I don't want to waste your time so like this so we have set up our model and uh, user model and product model so we will see you in the next video how I will import this dummy data into our uh, um, mango mango DB using the database seeding like in uh, PHP we use um, database seeder okay to seed the dummy data into the um, into the database something like this so I will show you in the next video